Hey guys, Ben here, and welcome back to another video on The Flash Season 5, and today we're going to be talking about a new theory and a new explainer video that I've been wanting to do for the last few days, because we actually talked about this in the 4-way crossover stream on Paige's Twitch the other day, so we briefly touched on the idea that I'll be going over in more depth in this video, but if you didn't actually check that out, it was on Twitch, it was on Paige's Twitch, so it wasn't on YouTube, so maybe you missed it. I think there may be a playback. You guys can go watch that out. It was a stream with Pagey, Eric's Reloaded, Boba Talks, and myself. We've been doing that for a year now, so I think this is like our anniversary. I think we started maybe around Comic-Con time last year. So, you know, we've been doing it every month, and it's been really awesome. So definitely be sure to check that out if you can. And so today we're going to be talking over what we actually said in that and it was just like one brief segment. So if you do go on to enjoy the video, please be sure to leave a like and a comment and subscribe if you're new so you don't miss any DCTV videos later this year. So we're gonna be talking about why Nora should be erased and she should be never born due to her coming back in time. So when she returned and everyone was made aware of her, it changes her future definitely. Like straight away, as soon as she reveals I'm your daughter, everything changes because everyone knows she exists and they will expect their daughter to be the same person that they see in present day right now and yet if Nora tells Barry or Iris when she was born that is the major factor because they will be pressured to actually give birth to her at that specific time that specific date and it will probably not end up being Nora because they will think about it too much and if you go through everything logically as soon as she comes back in time therefore she should be erased and whatever daughter or son or anything they have in the future should be different and therefore this version of Nora that we're seeing should be erased because you know it's probably not going to end up the same due to the fact that if Nora reveals so much about herself Barry and Iris are going to have more information and the more information they have the more likely Nora isn't going to be this Nora so therefore by the end of the season, I think it would be a really interesting twist if she ceases to exist and Barry will have to try his best to make her exist that exact same version and probably the only way, and maybe there's a little amount of other ways, would be that he and Iris and everyone must forget about her in present day due to the fact that with her being back in time it's totally problematic and she should definitely not exist in the future that same specific version. I'm not saying that a version of Nora couldn't exist in the future, I'm just saying this specific person that we're talking to in present day would not be the same due to Barry and Iris being so aware of all this stuff. So I think it's really down to if Nora tells Barry and Iris when she's actually born in the future, because if she says that, it puts pressure on them and it's probably not going to turn out the same way that it would have in that other future. So this was just a small explainer video, so I'm totally down for Nora being around, I'm just going through the logistical aspects of what's going to be happening next season, and I'm not trying to shit on her character, all I'm saying is, logically, Barry's going to have to forget, or something massive's going to have to happen, for Nora to actually exist in the same way in the future, considering their interactions in season four and now into season five. So thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys later. Goodbye. It doesn't make us strong, it doesn't make us weak. Tongue tied to service like shy pretty.